But okay, let us go ahead and begin uh, main story here. Talk to Wise and then uh, begin special episode. Well, you had a tough day. Don't forget to rest early today. Uh, we got things to do tomorrow. We need to go out tomorrow. Yeah, we need to go to a supplier at Lumina Square early tomorrow. We're not that familiar with this supplier, so you won't uh, prioritize keeping the goods stuff for us a pick. So let's get there early. Are we going to sleep now? Uh, yep. Let's enter our stereotyping mode. All right, let's go. Also, yeah, I get the feeling these special episodes are going to be like episodes that don't involve the proxy. Or at least heavily don't involve the proxy. Because, <laughs> same with Jane's quest, uh, the proxy wasn't really involved in that at all. So, we're probably going to get things only from Section 6 aside. Up, oh, Lumina Square for the HIA Club. There's so many people at Lumina Square today. Good. Uh... Yeah. Faithen! Oh. Uh... Whoa. No, no, that's not Faithen. It's no face. <laughs> it's not surprising you confused them. Ever since Faithen went quiet, no face has been one of the top proxies. No face? Never heard of him. <laughs> What's so great about no face? Are they really that good? Up, to Up against the famed Section 6 with the Void Hunter Miyabi in charge? I'd say no face is out of options. Hmm. Also, she can only Hazel? Is that you? <laughs> What? Why, why? Why is my first thought like on seeing these NPCs like it's it's Hazel from Genshin? What the hell? Whoa, Lady is here. Oh God! All <laughs> <laughs> oh, right, they have their own like fan clubs and shit, right? <laughs> Lady Miyabi, hey yo! <laughs> Alrighty, this easy fandom is already getting represented. Let's go. Hey yo! No, no, that came out all wrong. <laughs> hey, fucking yo! What the hell? No wonder it's so crowded. They're all fans of Section Six. Looks like they're hosting an event here. Ah, I see we found the, the down bad part of the ZZ fandom. <laughs> Should we get out of here? We don't want to be another notch on Section 6's belt like no face. What are you talking about, Belle? We're law-abiding citizens. Uh, oh no. Did she hear us? Oh, oh god. <laughs> uh, oh no. What's wrong, Deputy Chief? <laughs> it's probably just my imagination. But I feel like something is about to happen. Uh. Oh shit. Oh, th oh, this null face. Okay. Uh, did no one see that billboard glitch out? Special episode: Virtual Revenge. Beneath the Hollow Affairs Neutralization Department headquarters in your video's throne quarter. Also, yeah. Um, just making sure. Is the audio working fine for you guys? Because um. Yeah, is the game too loud or anything like that? Because uh, I haven't actually properly checked before we like started here. I'm gonna lower it a little bit just to make sure. Oh, hey! Oh yeah, that's a new area they uh, showed, right? Section six headquarter uh, headquarters. Hound. Hey, Tsukishiro from Section Six. Congrats! You sorted out that troublesome case, right? Ah, you're from Section 6. Thank you for your concern regarding that case. There's still some loose ends to tie up. Good job, this has been pretty tough. The Kana's con consensus at the case uh, briefing was that this case required immense intelligent work. As an intelligence officer, your contributions were indispensable. Also, yeah, why does Yanagi get no fans? <laughs> I've noticed that, like, they're not cheering for everybody else but Yanagi. <laughs> uh... You're too kind. It's just part of my duty. It wasn't too much effort or too much work. Nor can I claim the credit alone. It was a team effort. You're always so modest. That's why out of everyone in Section 6, you're my favorite to work with. Oh, by the way, someone's looking for you. Looking for me? A HIA staff member who's just asking me to contact in Section 6 to discuss cooperation. I didn't even hesitate to tell him. You wait for the Deputy Chief, uh, Sukishiro Yanagi. She's the only reliable one in Section 6. Please don't say that next time. All of executive officers are reliable. <laughs> Sorry, my bad. I didn't even think you would be afraid of the extra work, haha. Anyway, that HIA guy is, prob uh, guy is probably uh, waiting for you at 
the Sector 6 office. You better go and beat them as soon as possible. Okay. Hey, we actually get the place, sir. Good lord. What is that shirt? Yanagi, you need to get yourself like a bigger shirt or something. Holy fuck. <laughs> I, I, jeez. Why does it, why does it like the, the girls get bigger and bigger for every release? Well, at least for this game, we're not going to get another Rosari situation because this is a, like a 16 plus game, right? Yeah. Let me through. Oh, see, those high heels must be a pain to like walk in. Not to mention fight in. Ah, I don't understand how some of the, the Genshin or just any of the girls in these Hoi games do that for that matter. How the fuck do you fight in high heels? <laughs> I think Rosari is a prime example. <laughs> All right. Enter hand headquarters. Also, like, who is this man, like, with the statue here? <laughs> does Yanaki do that post every time I stand still? Oh, yeah, she does. Always with the hands on the hip. Just every time I move. <laughs> hey, uh, men in black. You got something for me? It's Executive Officer Tsukishiro. Uh, do you want to enter the office? I do. Let's go. Oh, see, can I find any, like, chests here or anything? I just want to make doubly sure. Oh, wait, no, I can't explore freely. Damn it. Hey, yo, my boy. Hey, oh, wow, the whole crew's here. Hello, Miyabi. It's a shame you're not coming in 1.4. Chief, the clipboard, clipboard says you have a regular meeting today. Don't forget to attend, okay? If you hadn't reminded me, I could have blissfully forgotten about it. I wonder Yanagi said that part earlier. I'm planning to attend. Are you not planning to attend? If you forget, there'll be consequences. Have you forgotten that last time already? A member of the Hoshimi family won't make the same mistake three times. I will come up with a strategy to avoid punishment. Three times? Have... <laughs> Does that imply she's already missed it twice? <laughs> hey, Sakaku. I kind of kind of feel bad for you after after I watched the uh, Yanagi teaser. Hey. Also, I, I want to talk to you, not your book. Nagi, the snacks in the break room are running low. How's that possible? I remember the administration staff replenished them just yesterday. How much is left? Three quarters left. Was well, indeed almost gone. All gone. Uh, at most, it'll last you two more rounds. I'll talk to them, but you have to be you have to behave until then, okay? Yep. <laughs> I'll see. I do want to know what Sukaku sounds like now, considering they changed her BA for the freaking third time. Also, yeah, what's her book here? There's some ABC handwriting books on Sukaku's desk and a uh, filing cabinet. Want to read through them? Sure, why not? <laughs> Based on Sukaku's penmanship inside, there aren't so much ABC handwriting books as they are XYZ mistake making books. <laughs> Does that confirm Sukaku's illiterate? <laughs> hey, Aramasa. Deputy Chief, you worked hard. A uh, near reader has been calm recently. And the citizens are at peace. Is there really a need for us to be on duty? Really, I'll go ask the director in, in your name if he agrees that everything is calm and peaceful then. Oh, come on, Deputy Chief. That, re that reply has even less entertaining than your usual jokes. <laughs> no sucking off, Haramasa. Okay, now let's proceed on with the story. <laughs> Sorry for delaying. <laughs> let's uh, actually continue. Hello. You're the HIA rep who booked to discuss cooperation today, right? Uh, yeah. I'm going to respond clearly and directly, explain why I'm here, and show off my cool professional side. <laughs> uh, did you mean to say that out loud? Uh, yeah. I'm so sorry. That's me. Uh, I mean, I'm me. I mean, I'm the HIA rep. Yes. <laughs> I swear I didn't sound this stupid when I was practicing in my head, but just thinking about talking with an elite from Section 6 made me... Yeah. <laughs> Please relax. We're no different from any other task force, except... Yep. Yanagi, can I skip the next chief briefing? I'd like to continue my training of never attending briefings. Oh yeah, they updated uh, Miyavi's model, didn't they? Because people kind of complained that her eyes are too far apart. Yeah, her eyes look like much bigger now. That training will only get you complaints and a bonus cut. Yeah. <laughs> you have to attend the briefing, chief. No slacking. <laughs> Nagi, what's this lunchbox with barium meal written on it? Is it a snack? Can I eat it? <laughs> okay, yeah, her VA is definitely different than this. It seems a bit closer to her second VA. It, yeah, it does seem somewhat similar, but you can. It, that's definitely a difference. No, you can't. Yeah. That's medicine. <laughs> Asaba brought it to use as proof when he was pretending he had a stomachache to get a sick day. Oh, dick. <laughs> what? 
Deputy Chief, how did you know I was faking it? Yeah. I mean, <laughs> how could you accuse me of that? <laughs> because the sick leave request you submitted last week had a photo of this exact same box. I've rejected tonight's leave request on behalf of the Chief, so don't forget about your night shift. No, oh my god. <laughs> but everybody here is stupid, <laughs> except for Yanaki. <laughs> Uh, tuning out the bickering behind her, a mix of immaturity, calm reasoning, and fake sickness, the tall deputy chief and intelligence officer kept her poised. Friendly smile as she turned back to the visitor. Forgive me. No. Uh, you were saying you're not- Exactly. Oh, fuck. Everyone's personalities are just a little- No, I meant to click skip. I didn't mean to skip through your dialogue. Forgive me. Now, where were we? Uh, you were saying you're no different from the other task forces? Exactly. Everyone's pretty more distinct. So let's get to the matter at hand. What did you want to discuss? Okay. <laughs> Sorry, I clicked up here instead of like clicking the right. yeah, this one. I'm here on behalf of the HIA to invite Section 6 to participate in a test of our latest next-gen VR system. Oh boy. All the necessary application processes have already been confirmed with the higher-ups. Ah, so that's what it is. Yes, I did receive a note from the department head. Assisting our partner organization in refining their new VR system by entering the virtual space as test users to evaluate system performance. Okay, but why section six though? Why can't it be like anybody else? But if I remember correctly, it said it would be voluntary. If you'll allow me to ask everyone first. Yeah. If participating in this means I can skip the briefing, I'm in. God damn it. <laughs> Do we get to go to the HIA club? Oh, oh come on. Snacks there. <laughs> gotcha. Aha! Uh -huh. Doing the VR test means I can skip my shift, right? Count me in. You, you are slackers. Cut. <laughs> they always come together in moments like this. <laughs> All right. As you can see, Section Six is willing to participate in the VR test. We'll head to the specified address. We look forward to working with you. Oh my goodness! <laughs> I see this faction just as stupid as all the other ones. In a good way, though. I wonder if this is gonna like replace my new favorite faction, because as of right now, my favorite faction is uh, Sons of Caledon. But who knows? Maybe this one will be better, <laughs> or maybe I'll like them more. Who knows? Fantastic! I'm gonna tell everyone at the office that it was my professional communication skills that got Section Six to work with us. Yeah. Maybe I'll even sneak a selfie as a souvenir. You're thinking out loud again. And this is a classified area, so taking pictures is prohibited. Gasp. Did you just say gasp out loud? <laughs> Later. <laughs> okay. Later, a hall of special operations section six arrived at the HIA. <laughs> this is already off to a great start. Not hearing step on me in a Hoyo game yet. <laughs> that, that's like the first line of the quest too. Like not even five minutes into the quest and it's already just like that. <laughs> just bro. <laughs> Uh, Deputy Chief Sukishiro, hello. We're so grateful that uh, everyone from Section 6 could spare some time to uh, assist us in collecting data for the VR system. Thank you so much. I'm in charge of the test today. It's nice to meet you. We should be thanking you. It's very nice to be working with you. Oh, by the way, I heard you're Lady Miyabi's most trusted person. She's entrusted almost everything, you know, all the paperwork and a lie distance tasks to you. So it's no exaggeration to say that you're the one who's actually bears the responsibilities of the Chief of Section 6. In addition to your duties as an intelligence officer and the daily tasks of a deputy chief, you have to do so much in place of the chief. It was exhausting living a, like that, right? When you open your eyes in the morning, you probably don't want to go to work at all. You're quite, you're quite straightforward, aren't you? Oh no, I'm sorry, did I come off as too straightforward? Actually, I've always had trouble grasping the sense of distance with my colleagues, which is an issue on my part. It's not a weakness. We have people in Section 6 who are far more set in their ways, but they're all out and out experts when it comes to completing things in their work domain, and that's good enough. One of our responsibilities is to handle all necessary communications beyond the scope of their job. <laughs> like what we're doing now. Oh, thanks for understanding. Are you here to check up on how test preparations are going? We're all set up and ready to go here. Just bring everyone in and we can start the test anytime. I'll be waiting for you at the club. I see. I'll go and rally everyone. Oh boy. What's everybody doing? Of course Harmas is chatting up the ladies. <laughs> of course he is. Alright, uh, Miyabi, the hell are you doing here with Magnet Boo? 
Lady Biabi, thank you, thank you. You just eliminated my the commanding hall that killed my parents. Not to start a new life, and it's all thanks to you. I just came here to express my gratitude. I'm gonna come stronger. Uh, if I keep working hard, surely I'll be as strong as Lady Miyabi one of these days. How can a powerful like you, Lady Miyabi? Tell me how. Wow, have you been this powerful since you were a baby? What well, runs through your head when you draw your katana? The mysterious, uh, the mysteries of martial power, the ultimate truth, the universe, or just what are what you're having for lunch? Weird question. When I draw my blade, I just think about drawing it. That's all. I see, just like a badge on your chest says, truly a thought process worthy of being every new guardian. <laughs> what a classic chief thing to say. Inagi, there you are. Are you all prepared? Are your preparations all ready for the combat test? All preparations have been made. Uh, once you've finished with your duties here, chief, please uh, proceed directly to the club. Mm hmm. Let's blitz through this and get home early. There's still uh, fragments of Null Face group at large, so we can't let a guard down. That's what I was thinking. Hopefully, we can wrap this test up quickly, uh, quick and easy. Oh, wait! Hey, <laughs> Bell and Wiser here. Can't believe I'm seeing the real second six. That's awesome. I feel my heart racing. My heart's also racing, but it's probably for a different reason <laughs> than yours. <laughs> That's cool. I didn't even notice these guys here before. Alrighty, Sakaku, what are you doing? Sakaku really excuses that about 10 years back, my precious daughter was also just as innocent and pure. She used to love eating the apples from the garden. Goodness me, what happened to your daughter? She, 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 she's now currently studying for a doctorate in ether physics and only comes home on the weekends. And all she talks about is school time, school that. It's not cute at all. Oh, come on. <laughs> ha, you just want to show off about your daughter. Okay, never about my daughter. Here, Sakaku, have an apple. Oh, thank you. Apple so good. <laughs> Nagi, you want one too? Sakaku, how many times I told you that you might get into trouble if you take food brought by normal citizens? Trouble? Don't worry, Nagi. Only livers have powerful detox functions. It doesn't even matter if I eat food that's gone bad. That's not what I meant. If you always gobble down whatever they give you, then your fans will be embarrassed to show up empty handed. In the long run, they'll be a burden on them. Oh, yeah, that's right. Even though I'm really hungry, I don't want to eat anybody out of... But I don't want to eat anybody out of the house, out of house and home. I want to, uh, I want everyone to be happy when they come meet me. Oh, uh, Sukaku, are you an angel? You're definitely an angel, right? Now I can accept all their gifts. Look, a really pretty hairpin, a new Arena Guardian badge, and this braided bristle that says Sukaku is the 10th cutest in the world. 10th <laughs> cutest? That's impossible. Our Sukaku has to be the number one cutest. Well, upon closer inspection, it actually says the cutest. If that's so, then I guess you should wear everyone's gifts then, Sakaku. <laughs> awesome! So, Sakaku, the test is ready to begin. Please say goodbye to everyone and come find me at the club. Your thing, Nagi. I'll finish up here real soon and then head over. <laughs> Cute. Yeah, why is it like more concerned about being found out as faith than meanwhile Bell's just like, oh my god, section six is here. <laughs> I really I really do love the distinct personalities between the two. Anyways, Harumasa, why are you chatting up the ladies, huh? I'm so happy. This is the first time I've been so close to Har Haru Masa Masa. <laughs> He's so handsome. Your hair is so soft. That guardian bat on his chest suits you so well. He smells so good. I like herbal aroma. Is it pheromones? It's definitely pheromones, right? Mr. Haramasa, tell me, tell me, what, what type of girls are you into? Do you prefer summer or winter? What brand of shampoo do you usually use? Where do you go for archery practice? Carbon fiber or fiberglass bows? You an older sister, Haramasa Masa? I really want to be your older sister. I can be born as your older sister. You seem pretty busy there, Asaba. Also, what the hell? These girls seem insane. <laughs> what the hell? <laughs> Deputy Chief, save me. <laughs> save you? I could. But it can't be late for your weekend overtime. I have to submit your mission reports on time. <coughs> My chest feels tight. S what if I just so happen to get sick over the weekend? Goodbye then. Deputy Chief! Sukishiro! Okay, whatever you say. Ahem. Asaba, our mission is about to begin. Go out of your bow and arrow, the city might be in grave danger. Uh, tie things up with your hands fast, and we'll be waiting for you in the club. I see which Deputy Chief. I notified everyone now, so... 
Um, Miss Yanagi. Oh, it's you. Long time no see. Ah, Miss Yanagi, you remember me? Even though we haven't talked directly, I remember there was a period of time when I saw you often. You even helped our staff maintain order when uh, some citizens got a bit too excited, correct? Wow, you're such a good memory. I couldn't follow such a schedule recently because I was preparing for an interview. It seems like the interview went well, yes? Yes, I achieved my dream. Working for the government and the mayor. <laughs> I don't think working for the government should be your new dream, buddy. <laughs> Have you guys seen Transformers 1? There's like one joke in there that's just like, Oh my god, this is a dream come true. I get to work for the government. <laughs> Which I found really fucking funny. Uh, but that job is in the Vulcan Quarter. I probably won't have the chance to see everyone from Section 6 anymore. Can I just say that Section 6 has always been my favorite motivation? Uh, been my motivation? I'll protect the city just like you all, in my own way. So before I leave, I want to take a photo of all four of you. I know this request is a bit abrupt. Of course, it'll be an honor for us. <laughs> Please wait a moment, I'll convey your wish to my colleagues. Picture Tom! Oh, <laughs> who are these random ass people in it? <laughs> Why are Bell and Wise here? Yo, what the hell? Bell, Weiss, what are you doing here? <laughs> okay, well, everybody say cheese. <laughs> Sakaka's just there thinking about food. All right, good photo. Wow, I treasured this photo for my whole life. Wait, I don't, I didn't blink, right? Thank you. Thank you, Mr. Yanagi. Thank you, Lady Miyabi. Thank you, little Sakaka and everyone from Section 6. Thank you. Wow. <laughs> wow, thank everybody but Haramasa, why don't you? Thank you for support. Your work in the Vulcan quarter will definitely go well. <laughs> she didn't even mention my name just now. Am I the only one who's everyone from Section 6? <laughs> Do you like being called that? I'll call you that from now on. Chief, tell me, are you geniusly that clueless or the evilest being the greatest world in the last hundred years? Huh? Nagi, when are we going to the HIA club for snacks? <laughs> It's not for snacks, but for work. I believe they are finished up with preparations. I'll go ahead. You all take it up. You all take your time to catch up. To K-pop fans be like, yeah, you're not wrong. I'll see. Why? Why were Bell and Wise part of the photo? <laughs> they just kind of like sneaked in last second. Anyways, let's begin. Let's go do some VR. Deputy Chief Tsukishiro, you're back. Is everyone from Section Six ready to go? Yes, they'll be arriving here shortly. Since we have some time before we begin, there's something I'm curious about and would like to ask you if that's all right. Uh, of course. Where would you like to start? Uh, here's my electronic medical record with all my uh, physiological information, and here's my knock knock ID. Just I don't need that. Me as a friend, no verification needed, and this is my. <laughs> oh, hold on. You misunderstand. I'm not interested in you personally. Oh, damn. I just wanted to ask a few technical questions about the test. <laughs> Bro got shot down. <laughs> uh, uh, I see. Sorry about that. I got a little excited there and misunderstood. <laughs> <laughs> uh, <laughs> <laughs> He's like crying. Right stealing your tears with laughter just makes you sound even more pitiful. <laughs> Most sane because <laughs> ZZZ fans. Ah shit! What that say? Across department. Uh, I didn't see. I didn't read that. He answers Yanagi's questions one by one with an overly cheerful yet seemingly tearful voice. Later, Yanagi holds a small briefing of her teammates who uh, just wave goodbye to their fans. Our mission is to collaborate across to help the HIA test their latest VR system. Across apartments. Okay, there we go. Basically, the core feature of this new VR system is its unprecedented deep sync with sensory nerves. Simulations with such deep levels of immersion are better at tricking the brain into improved training results by convincing your body that a virtual experience is in fact real and not just visual stimulation. Of course, they've blocked off all pain sensors for this test. The plan is to roll out this new VR platform to public security, the defense force, regular investigators, and even the general public. So a standardized value system needs to be developed. Okay. Our task is to enter the simulation and conduct comprehensive battles. The text here will set our combat data as the maximum limit inside the system. Once we finish modeling all the virtual data, our mission will be complete. Any questions? Let's play VR, essentially. I've got a question. Yep. I've already persuaded the staff to help us submit the task report after it's completed. So you'll just need to notify the director when we're done, Chief. <laughs> I have no you questions. Have questions from me. God damn it. <laughs> oh, man. You just... 
Yeah, she just knows what every single member just wants, right? Me, me. <laughs> no, Sakaku, there'll be snacks after the VR training's done. The HIA will provide us with work meals and some snacks. Yep. <laughs> I've asked them to allocate extra for you, Sakaku. <laughs> no questions at all. Yay! You're the best, Nagi. <laughs> I have a question as well. <laughs> no, Haramasa, you still need to work overtime. No, you may not take any leave. <laughs> all right, then, if there are no further questions. Wait, Deputy Chief, I wasn't asking about taking any leave. Oh, my mistake. <laughs> That's odd. Odd? I think it's odd that you know the answer before even hearing the question. If I tried that with the girls in the intelligence unit, they'd think I was stalking them. <laughs> okay, so what's your question? Uh, can I go now? <laughs> How long are we supposed to conduct comprehensive battles? There is no time restriction. It depends on the HIA's requirements. However, based on the design of this test system, the session will end automatically once we defeat all the test monsters. What's that book you're holding? Yep. It's the technical manual for the VR system. I borrowed it from the staff. Most of the information I just shared came from it. What does it say on page 273? Uh. It covers the three methods for initiating safe mode within the system and an analysis of their applicable scenarios. That's weird. You said that without even flipping through the book. Did you memorize the whole thing? <laughs> if you keep this up, you'll start losing your hair. <laughs> Was it just all a test, Harvath? <laughs> Yanagi, I want you to be the executor of my estate after I retire. <laughs> It's a little early to be planning for that, Chief. All right, let's put the strange questions aside and get ready to start testing. Um, Nagi, are there any unknown dangers in this virtual world? Don't worry, the HIA staff will be with us every step of the way. And also, I'll be here. I'll take care of everyone. Of course you will. No. <laughs> God damn it, I just... <laughs> that whole scene was great. Okay, uh, can I talk to everybody before we head in? Armasa? Uh, okay, I guess I can't talk to any of them. Where's Sukaku at? Oh, there she is. <laughs> yeah, I, I honestly took this faction to be, like, a bit more serious than the rest of the other factions of the game. Nope, they're just as stupid. <laughs> just as everybody else. And honestly, I love that. <laughs> We all could use a little stupid in our lives. All right. Oh, hey, actually, I don't think you actually go in here before. Actually, wait, no, could you? Oh, no, no, I think you could have, like, if, if you're playing a spell. Yeah, or wise. Anyways, let's begin. Yeah, we're going all SAO all over again, yeah. <sighs> Proceed with the VR test now? Yes. Just a sense of the manual, but everyone shouts the key phrase at the same time. This is supposed to start loading up the test <laughs> the test stage. Link Stato! <laughs> the key phrase is To protect the city, I, Professor Mimi, will become the light. Huh? <laughs> Who the fuck is Professor Mimi? <laughs> so your name is Professor Mimi, I take it. Oh no, that's just an example. The cat who lives in our lab is called Professor Mimi. <laughs> the cat? All together then, everyone! To protect the city, I, Oshimi Miyabi, will become the light. To protect the city, uh, I, Asaba Harmasa, will become the uh, light. To protect the city, Suk I, Sukaku, uh, will become light. To protect the city, I, Suki Sukishiro Yanagi, will become light. In we go. <laughs> Ah, here again. Welcome to Sword Art Online. Wow. This is so cool. It feels just like being outside. Oh, uh, and I've got this. Yeah? Let me see that. It's got a realistic weight, too. All right, then. <laughs> oh, shit. <laughs> My weapon feels perfect, too. Simulating it to this level. Well done. Oh, wow, getting complimented by Biabi. I'll never forget this day. To make testing easier, I've added a progress marker for everyone. Uh -huh. When it turns green, it means the background data collection is done. And that's the sign we're done for the day, right? 
Well then, let's begin the combat test. Let's begin. Um, yeah, so far only Yanagi and uh, Sakaka are playable, right? I know, I tested uh, Yanagi, I don't need to do this again. Yeah, it's only Sakaku and Yanagi. They talk less than actual rebels, which is good. <laughs> oh, hey! Okay, come on, we do get uh, the Agent Boo. That's weird. Maybe it's a bang with us coming in the next update or something. Alright. Hold. Boom. Nice. Boom. Real or fake, Oh, and we're done already. Is this a training program for the elevators? I've always wanted to see what they can do. Yeah, I kinda I kinda think these enemies a bit too quickly here. <laughs> I try to slow things a bit downwards. Yeah, I got him Sakaku. Uh, it's so weird having the VHH again. <laughs> like I'll get used to it eventually, but man, why do they have to change it for the third time? Up. Uh, who's deployed? Who is it now? Oh, all three at the same time? Alright. The virtual arena suddenly loses all deadly aura as the snarling digital enemies freeze in place, striking poses. A slightly distorted voice from the staff echoes throughout their virtual space. Oh no. Oh, uh, here we go. Um? Uh, what? Um, Zealous seems to be frozen. Game? Oh, for fuck's sake. God damn it. Zealous has crashed. Wait, don't tell me. Huh? Is that the end of it? Um... I hope I didn't miss anything. The, huh? The HIE sincerely thanks everyone for your help. We would definitely put six six combat data to good use. As guy, we, we, we could be a service. If it's alright, we'll be off now. We set to the parking lot. It's an official car waiting for you, and we'll take you all back, just like how we brought you here. Huh? Uh. What? I I hope I didn't miss any. I, I, hmm. Is that cutscene I missed? I hope not. Hmm. Meanwhile, oh, back to us. Okay. Where are they coming out? I've been waiting here since, since this morning. I really want to see Lady Abby again. Me too. I got more questions for her, Masa Masa. Sakako's too hungry by now. Should I order her some takeout? Citizens, citizens, I understand how passionate you all are, but Sector 6 is executive officers of official, important official duties and I have to get, go back soon. <laughs> Even if they. Didn't. So they'd be resting in the club's VVIP lounge. Wow, VVIP, okay. So there's no point in waiting here, so we won't get any chance to meet them. I expect all these people uh, still smiling around even after we finish our restocking trip. And one particular you're waiting for? Rather than a person, I'm more interested in learning what the inside of the VVIP lounge looks like. I'm so confused. Is that, was that supposed to happen, or...? I don't know. In Lumina Square parking lot. It's not just the HIA car that's not here. There's no sign of any vehicles around. I'm certain this is the direction a staff member pointed us towards. Has something happened? Oh, are they still in VR? Oh, shit. Wait, are they still like in VR and they're like tricked into being reality? Just then the rest of the second six arrives at the parking lot. I don't see any car. Should we walk back instead? Yeah, let's see that. Let's take a walk and patrol at the same time. Chief Sakaku, aren't you a little too unfazed? This situation seems fishy any way you look at it. 
Tiffany Chief, what do you think? There are many possibilities that could have led to our current predicament. Let's rule them out one by one, then. Agreed. Let's go back and ask the staff what's going on. Okay. That is, like, extremely weird. Oh, hey, and that's a Yanagi, uh, wallpaper. Hmm, I gotta say, though, her wallpaper looks mighty fine, I gotta say. I, I really like the way she's holding her, those glasses. Hmm. <laughs> that's one reason I'm intending to get Yanagi, but, uh, unfortunately, Lighter is, uh, coming soon. Uh, the tough choice I have to make sometimes. Oh, the staff who was hosting us before and the receptionists, they're all gone. Yanaki, don't you find the current situation strange? Even our chief realizes that things are weird, then it truly must be the weirdest of the weird. I suggest splitting to investigate as teams. What do you said what do you think, Chief? Let's do it. Asaba, Yusokaku, take the stairs. Yanaki, come in and check inside with me. Got it, Sakaku, come with me. Okay. That's totally what it is, right? We're totally still in VR, I think. But yeah, what do you think about all this? I checked and found no one. Just be on the safe side. You can go and check inside again. I'll wait here. Hmm. Nagi, Harmasa and I just went up the stairs and we saw... Absolutely no one. Where's everyone gone? Hmm. Oh boy. This VR machine is still lit up. Huh. I noticed this when we came in. Nobody's using them all, but all these machines are still on. Everyone gathers together. As expected, it's kind of creepy. This place was bustling just before, but now all of a sudden there's no way around. Is this place haunted? What, by you? Saba. I'm sorry, I couldn't help myself. She set me up. At some point, continuing our investigation here. Let's check outside. I agree with Chief, uh, the Chief's assessment of the situation. If things don't work out, we can always just walk back. <laughs> I think we already might have come too far for us to just walk back. Hmm. Yep. Welcome to Lumina Square. Oh, but nobody's around. The hell? Am I dreaming, Nagi? I didn't know people in Lumina Square. At the Lumina Square I know, the hot pot joint is just is bustling like crazy even at uh, 3 in the morning. Sakaku, children should not be in bed by 3. Next time, you are not allowed to go out uh, so late for snacks. Okay, Nagi. Are right, you guys keeping up your stand-up comedy routine in the situation this weird? Are you two really that close? Never mind. Though I'm not holding out any hope whatsoever. Let's still investigate thoroughly. Oh. I'll go check the uh, shops down there. How about you, Chief? Then I'll go and double check the parking lot. You know, you and Sokaku can investigate inside the mall. Alright, let's meet up after our respective investigations to sharing discoveries. Yeah, we, we're totally still in VR. Hmm. Hey, Armasa, what are you doing here? You find anything unusual, Asaba? Look, Deputy Chief, this tile, that's called Pallor or my conscious. One of them has to be wrong. What do you mean? Huh? You're kidding, right, Deputy Chief? This tactile path goes right across the road. There's no way a traffic like roulette. There's no way this traffic like roulette game is right. Oh, I see. Given how you've been absent, your consciences have been wrong for a while, so I thought you were defending the tactile path. <laughs> Are you serious, Deputy Chief? That's so mean. <laughs> you think has been covering for all your absences. Who's been filling your leave explanations? And who's been handling your vacation requests? Er, uh, thanks, Deputy Chief. I'm sorry for the trouble. Glad you realize uh, you're causing trouble. Actually, I didn't handle any of that stuff for you. Make sure to get it all done after the mission, hmm? Seriously, Deputy Chief, that's so not cool. What the heck? <laughs> Why are these in a cross pattern? 
Huh. I'm just checking around the town to see if anything's like wrong. Doesn't look like it. Hmm. But those X's definitely weren't there before. Uh, hey, Sakaku. What's with all those trash cans, the hell? <laughs> hmm, so weird. Sakaku? Anything wrong with these trash cans? Nagi, I figured it out. The savages at Lumina Square must taste awful. It's not quite the problem we're looking for, but go ahead. What do you think so? Because a lot of people are throwing their sandwiches away. Look, the sandwich in the trash with just one bite taken. Here's another one just one bite in the trash can. Take this one. And this one. Look at this one, too. They also could buy it from the same spot and toss it the same way. It must taste really, really bad for everyone to throw it away like that. Hmm. It not really be that awful. Kind of curious to taste about the taste now. No, you're not touching that. And don't go checking trash cans again. I'll make you a nice meal when, you, when we get home, okay? Okay, Nagi. I don't know trash cans and even the same... The things thrown in them are nearly the same. But they really have so many trash cans? Yeah, we're getting some, some glitchy shit right here. And those are definitely not supposed to be so long. Yeah, those are definitely wrong. Chief, did you notice anything unusual? Yes, this one. It's way long compared to the others. It's it, unusually long. I'm sure we're down to the same length. Just one cut will do. That is your public property, Chief. This should be some masterpiece of artistic expression. So what's it trying to express? Hmm, the tallest trees catches the most wind. Oh, and how can you be so sure? Chief, didn't you want to just... <laughs> didn't you just want to cut it short? I see, that makes sense. A very well done artistic expression. I learned something new. I was familiar with Luminous Square. Was this artwork always like this? No, it's not. Inaki had never really thought of Luminous Square as particularly a large space before. With all the crowds gone, all the sounds, smells, and warmth vanish. Every trace of life and energy stripped away. What was left felt oddly eerie. It's just like... It's just like being inside a hollow. Hmm. From my chapter two, I'm in cooks. I just want hard masa content. Uh, you don't have to worry. You have, you have like three chapters to go through. Actually, no, four if you count the Jane Doe story. <laughs> yeah, you'll get there eventually. Please stop reading my mind, Deputy Chief. This is really starting to scare me. You're scared of an empty square? No, I'm scared of how many times your mommy has seen right through my leave requests. <laughs> My mommy? I've only got a sister! Let's share our findings on the investigation. Chief, have you got anything? Nah, she's more like your mommy. <laughs> Nothing. No matter how much I wave my sword around, nobody's coming to take a group photo or a selfie. I couldn't find anyone either. Feels like I'd be hiding until my tummy started growling if I played hide and seek here. Uh-huh. My tummy isn't growling! Why? I've been running around investigating all day. <laughs> Why am I not hungry? Am I sick? So, Kaku, do you really need to bug the deputy chief with stuff like this? Want to hear my theory about what's going on? Go on. New Eridu has been hit by a deadly plague. <laughs> That's definitely not what's going on, but <sighs> you proceed. Everyone must have been evacuated from Lumina Square while we were running those combat tests. As carriers of the virus, we've now been quarantined and cut off from everyone in this big empty square. That's definitely not the case. <laughs> Smack! Because loud sound rang out like something straight up uh, an 8 p.m. New York soap opera. Her hand raised, trembling slightly. His face turned aside a little red. <laughs> you hit me! Not even the chief has done that before! <laughs> uh, chief, put your hands down. That wasn't an invitation for you to hit me, too. <laughs> Just because I was talking about the plot from a movie I watched last night doesn't mean you had to hit me. My apologies. Did that hurt? <laughs> huh? And you're asking me if it hurt? You sound like one of those mean homeroom teachers. Wait. It didn't hurt, did it? No, it did not hurt. That's weird. 
I didn't feel anything. Just as I thought. This empty square we're in. The lack of fans hounding our chief. Sakaku's tummy. Asaba's lack of pain. We're still in VR. Instead of assuming thousands of people could be teleported away, let's begin with the assumption that the problem here lies with us. Are you saying we're actually... I wonder then. Would Hoi be so smart as to make... You know how the crash I got earlier? Was that crash intentional, I, I wonder? Or maybe it was like a pure coincidence. Hmm. I really gotta like look back on the story and see like if I didn't miss anything. Because uh, yeah, I, either the crash was intentional or... Hmm, I, I don't know. <laughs> God damn it, Saba. <laughs> now not the time to be making jokes. Yes, we're still in the virtual environment. Uh -huh. For some reason, we haven't been able to log out. I see. That explains a lot. Our brains? Are they in danger? Don't worry. Just in case, I can activate safety mode for everyone. I still remember the method outlined in the technical manual. I'm sorry for running my mouth earlier, Deputy <laughs> Chief. Uh, from now on, I'll fully support you memorizing the manual. And I'll buy you the finest hair conditioner on the market. <laughs> this is my first time seeing this Harabasa expression. <laughs> Okay, get me the latest shampoo from Carliche. <laughs> All right, team. Let's head back she didn't to the even hesitate. Club and try to find another way of logging out. All right. Back in we go. Hmm. Cuz yeah, did anybody else crash at that when you would try to, like after the cutscene where we when uh it's like you're just trying to log out of the game? Cause yeah, I do, I do. I do know some games do that sometimes with like an intentional crashing of the game. But I felt like maybe that was not intentional. Cause yeah, didn't the Hawkeye saw really do something like this? If you like got one of the bad endings, to just kick you straight to the menu, not crash your game. Hmm. I wonder. I want to look back on it, but I don't think you can actually like rewatch cutscenes until like you've uh. Until, like, you've done the full story. I say, Yanagi, stop staring at me like that. They're gonna make me pull for you. <laughs> okay, uh... Yeah, let's try and leave. Maybe. Safe mode activated. Yeah. Alright, you're up. Sukaku, come here. Okay, Nagi. What the fuck? Uh... Sakaku? Sakaku, Asaba, what's wrong? Whoa, whoa! No, no, no! Nagi, why isn't my body listening to me? Oh, shit. Oh, she's right. My body. It's like it's being controlled by something else. Oh, fuck. What? Chief, are you okay? Oh, no. I'm not. I had the urge to kill you about five minutes ago. Uh oh, oh, shit. Yo, Nagi. Leave it to me, Miyabi. <laughs> so this truly isn't the real world. Someone's tampered with things, preventing us from leaving. Wow, she she beat all three that Hello easily. Special operations section six. Oh, here we go. Heroes of New Era do. I'm afraid no one in this world needs your salvation. Okay, fuck off. That logo, it's. You're going Gay to face. be trapped here until your brains shut down. Yeah, shit. Oh. Oh. You're finally awake, Sakaku. Feeling pain anywhere? My head still hurts a little. Looks like the pain feedback in the test system has been fully engaged. Shit. I'm sorry for being a bit rough earlier. I had to make sure to stop everyone. It's okay, Naki. My headache isn't because of you. More like from earlier. Hmm. Seems like we're all in the same boat. A massive headache, then losing control and attacking teammates. Now we can be sure our failure to log out of the VR system was not an accident, but a deliberate act. Yeah, what are the fuck is doing on our outside anyways? The enemy sent a threat. And I can briefly tell us her teammates about her conversation with the unknown voice. That was brazen. Any idea who it could be? Yeah, the null face guy, isn't it? Also, yeah, what what is the staff doing on the outside? 
Shouldn't they be like trying to find a way to like, I don't know, like unplug the system, get us out of here or something? It's just speculation hmm. at this point, but the fact that the enemy was able to display information in front of us proves they've gained partial control over the VR system. Hmm. So waiting for rescue isn't a good idea. But if we act recklessly, we might fall into the enemy's trap. Yeah, definitely like an SAO situation. <laughs> but can they really set a trap without even showing up? This is a virtual world, and we're just data entities fully synced with our senses. Whoever controls the system is like a god here. They can do whatever they want. Hmm. The enemy delivered a threat at the risk of exposing their identity. Or perhaps that's what they want us to believe. What do you mean? Oh. As long as we can't figure out what they're capable of, the enemy will seem like a god. They flex their power to scare us, leaving us wondering what they can do within the system. That's their plan. They want to restrict our movements and keep us in check. How did you come to this conclusion, Yanagi? Our enemy threatened to destroy our brains by eliminating our data entities. Their mm. attempt to seize control of our bodies and attack our allies was one such effort. But if they had truly seized full control of this system, they could have resorted to far more efficient methods. True, they could have just like killed us at this point. So maybe they don't have full control. They could have simply destroyed our data, implanted a virus, ordered us to end ourselves, or even eradicated us along with this realm. Right. But they didn't. Hmm. So it's very possible they simply can't because they don't have full control over this system. That's possible. But maybe they're just not as devious as you and haven't considered doing it. I'd say hmm. that's impossible because they're up against us, Section 6. True. <sighs> They can't beat us in the real world, so they've gone to great lengths to trap us in the virtual world. We have the most promising Void Hunter in New Eridu, so if I were the enemy, I'd want to take us out quickly. The more they bluff, the more it proves there's still something we can do. Right. You're the most cautious person I know. <laughs> I've never seen you take action based just on speculation. I think I'm the most cautious person you've ever met, too. <laughs> what you've just heard are speculations from the most cautious of people. But I'm not taking risks because I'm reckless. Quite the contrary. The situation is dire, and we'll have to take the initiative to survive. Hmm. Yeah, Yanagi is like fucking proving that she's like, yeah, the actual brains of the group. I mean, let's be honest, I think she's the only one with a brain in this group. <laughs> I think the others just like, uh, share like only probably like six brain cells in total. <laughs> It's been a while since you spoke to Harumasa in such a serious tone, Yanagi. This reminds me of our first days in Section 6. Everyone, do you trust me? Well, you've laid it all out, and I don't have any other ideas. Like Harumasa said, this is all just speculation without any solid evidence. Mm. If we're wrong, things could get worse, and there's no turning back. Aw, Nagi's tail is drooping. Oh, wait! Nagi doesn't have a tail! Yeah, I was gonna say. <laughs> I have faith in you. As the chief, I'll take full responsibility for whatever happens. Just tell us what to do. Thank you, everyone. As for what we should do, hmm. I'm sure you all remember in the previous combat test, there were still three monsters left to defeat. Right, before my game crashed. Hmm. Yeah. They said they'd already gotten the data they wanted before we could take them down, right? Hmm. Exactly. And do you remember the briefing before the operation? About the rules I saw in the user manual? Once all test monsters are defeated, the test will automatically come to an end. So we gotta find right. them. So we need to go back to the test stage and finish off the last three enemies. But how? This is the best approach given the situation. But I'm sure our enemy won't just leave them there like sitting ducks. They have partial control over the system and will stop at nothing to eliminate us. We're just ordinary officers, while our enemy has far more resources and room for error. Hmm. Are you worried, Naki? No. It's our enemy who should be worried. Ooh. Are you hearing this, you shady coward? You're messing with the elites of New Eridu. Hmm. Okay, but how the hell are we gonna get there though? I'm not even sure if the VR place we're sent to is like even a real place in this world. Hmm. Here's not for all we know. 
Unfortunately, my soldier on service is still effective in this virtual world and it barely drains any stamina. Uh, that's about something. I was just wondering. I wonder what our bodies look like out there in the real world right now. Probably just in a state of unconsciousness. I would be threatened to trap us here forever until our brain shut down. If we believe them, then we don't have much time left. I don't like my brain shutting down. <laughs> I don't like my brain <laughs> Of course, nobody does. <laughs> Let's try to defeat the enemy quickly and find a way out. Of course, I'm always relying on your might, Chief. Alongside everyone else, that is finally something I can do for everyone. I just thought something else. Yanagi, you successfully enabled safe mode, didn't you? Correct. What about me, Yabi? Virtual data can be meddled with. In a worst-case scenario, you have a better chance than us of making it back to reality. Please don't say such things. Why? I will wait for you. I trust you'll come back for us, no matter how dangerous it might be. Uh, no matter how much time has passed in the virtual world, Hoshimi and Miyabi will fight until the very end, waiting for your return. <laughs> oh, you know, he's crying. Why do you look like, as though you're about to start crying? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> That's precious, actually. <laughs> yeah. Uh, view data status. What's this? Hmm, I'm not very good at activating that special mark uh, marking ring. You know, could you read that technique again? I see. You can turn it off now. <gasps> Watching my social service effective. Okay. Uh, that seems to be just all. All right. <laughs> Alright, uh, what about you, Skaku? You doing fine? Even though we're stuck with nothing to eat, I'm not hungry at all. That's a good thing, right, Nagi? Uh, view data status. You wanna see that shiny round thing? Okay, I'll call it out right away. I see. You can turn it off now. Even though we're stuck here... Okay, uh, ask about something. My stomach doesn't feel hungry at all. What a strange feeling. The good kind of strange, or the bad kind. I'm not sure. Feeling not being hungry, it's different to feeling full. My heart is empty and I don't feel the need to fill it all up. It's awful. Uh, I'm never full. The one who never gets full, that's meant to be me. To keep on surviving, I have to eat many precious uh, treasures. Everything I've ever ever, I ever loved. I turn into my own flesh and blood. If, if I don't want to eat anymore, then I don't know where all the precious treasures. Uh, where they've gone. Gently cradle Sakaku's small frame in your arms. Aw. <laughs> Give her hugs. <laughs> Nagi! I'm sorry to worry you, Nagi. Haha, <laughs> I don't really seem so down, down in the dumps. Never worry, Sakaku. We'll be out of here soon. Now to get out of here, we can go and get uh, kebabs together. Yay! Kebabs are delicious! I felt the death for my kebabs then. <laughs> Cute. Alright, what about you, Asaba? They expect to be trapped in a virtual world. When we wake up, will the world outside have changed beyond recognition? Data status. Are you talking about the marking ring that AJ ha added for me? Let me think. How do I activate it again? I see. You can turn it off now. Okay, still red. Uh, ask about something. Everything we just tried has been pretty telling. You can't even log out via safe mode, even with your help. <laughs> A current situation should be within your bounds of expectations, Asaba. Yeah, besides you, Sukishiro, who managed to secure your virtual data permissions when you enabled safe mode earlier, the Chief Sakaku and I might uh, lose all control and start attacking you at any moment. So are you sure you won't be speaking to me while I while standing so close? You're fine, Asaba. <laughs> Are you saying I'm weak and you could take care of me at any time you want? So what I meant. This is purely objective analysis. The closer you are, the less effective your bow and airs become. Good point. But even so, don't get any closer than we are now, okay? I wasn't playing to you. Hmm, alright. I wonder then, will we have to fight like the second six members like as bosses potentially? Hmm. I wonder. Okay, but let's try and get the fuck out of here first things first. <laughs> Should have people gel so Sakaku with the huge. <laughs> you have no need to elaborate with the, just the huge, the huge things that uh, Yanagi has. Her wallet. Uh, proceed with the VR test now? Yes. 
The goal is to restart the test stage and eliminate the remaining test monsters. Everyone, are you ready? If you're all ready, then everybody say that key phrase together. Uh, Spec the city, I, Hasaba Harmasa, will become light. To protect the city, I, Sakaku, will become light. To protect the city, I, Sukishiro Yanagi, will become light. To protect the city, I, Hoshimi Miyabi, will become light. Does that actually work? Hmm. Where the fuck are we now? Oh, what in Bellabog? The hell? Huh? Why do you change places? It seems the enemy has access permissions to allow them to change the stage environment. Okay. Not sure why they would do that, per se. But alright. There's a test target right up ahead. Oh, they're gonna be like all separated? Oh no, they're gonna be running away. Of course they will. Huh. Still bouncing around. Did I miss? The feel of the strike is fine. The enemy is tampering with monster data in the background. Ah shit. What the how are you still alive? There we go. Ow. Test subject is data errors. The mastermind has gained partial access to VR systems and can tamper with the in internal data of the test enemies. When defeated, these alter enemies will explode, dealing damage. Oh, oh, they're suicide bombers now. Okay. Oh god, more of you guys? Okay. Resistance to A joint effort. Okay. Get him, Haramasa. Whoa. Everyone, watch out! Oh, got more of you guys. Oh fuck! Oh god! Ah uh, shit! Done. <laughs> Wait, does Agent Blue have a door? <laughs> I notice that sometimes. Like, <laughs> does Agent Blue like have a door he fights with? Oh, I forgot about the explosions. Anyways, where's the monster at? Okay. Uh, can I actually go to him immediately? No, I cannot. Shall pay. Boom. Alright, not bad disorder damage. Yeah, look, it just has a door. <laughs> FBI, open up. <laughs> I kinda wanna get them now just because of the hat. <laughs> that is sick actually. What the Did you just jump down? Hey! Stop running! Name the law! Uh oh, we're taking the elevator down, okay. Oh, you meant hugs, not huge. <laughs> well, that's an unfortunate miss typo. Hey, get here. Oh, but they TP. He, he teleported, didn't he? Taking down cheating enemies? I impress even myself. I'm enjoying the fight, too. Oh, God, ow. Boom. Get him, Harmas up. Also, yeah, I do wonder how Harmas is gonna fight with like a bow and arrow and everything. I wonder if she's gonna like play like Julian, maybe. Oh god, yeah, you, it's fucking running. Come back here. Found you. Stop running. What the fuck? This whole trick? Oh great, and they're all T posing too. How about we just kill them all? Chief Miyabi, now! <laughs> oh yeah, kill him! No instinct. You know how to leave this virtual space. Talk. <laughs> You're never leaving. Oh great. Oh, oh we're back. 
I'm exhausted. Nagi, you did it! That's the deputy chief for you. <laughs> well <done>. <laughs> <laughs> Lots of thumbs up, dude. Everybody just gives. Ah, uh, I see. So this is how we can learn the enemy's weaknesses. Yanagi, your judgment uh, proves to be correct. I told you we should listen to Nagi. Harmasa, please don't argue Nagi next time, okay? Hey, I was just raising a very reasonable counterpoint. Arguing is bad, okay? <laughs> okay, okay. Next time, I'll definitely follow the Deputy Chief's orders. Happy now, Sakaku. Yep, Harmasa Masa's the best. <laughs> Thank you, everyone, for giving me your trust. Judging by our enemy's reaction, our plan seems to be effective. If everyone's still feeling up to it, then I suggest we strike while the iron's hot and seize our chance to catch the next runaway. Let's see that. The longer we wait, the higher the chance something goes wrong. But please, go get ready and let's end the test environment once more. Will do. Uh, can I talk to you guys again? Naki, once we're out, will all these exercises make us feel hungry? I'm scared I might get dizzy from hunger. Oh, I can just do the same things with the rings. The colors, the colors change. This isn't good. Wait, is, isn't that a good thing? Like, if it turns green, we're out of here, right? Why is that a bad thing? Good thing about battling in a virtual world is that my quiver is endless arrows. I can shoot as much as I like. Go check the status, just a sec. What the? Why is yours green? The colors change. This isn't good. Wait, huh? Why is yours green? Since your strategy is correct, let's strike with the iron's hot. Um, what's yours? Relax, the color hasn't changed. Weird, why are we all different colors now? Oh, they like plan to kick like Haramasa out first? Huh. And then just what, just leaving Miyabi? Hmm. Okay, I guess we'll see. All right, next monster. Hello? Uh. Game? Uh. What? It's, um. Oh, it's a bug? It's a soft block? Oh, what? Oh, come on, game. Please work. Yes, it works. We can continue with the story, folks. Hell yeah. Okay. All right. It does work on console. So if you're a PS5, if you're a PS5 user, don't worry. It, it does work. Whew. Let's fucking go. All right. After a quick uh, bit of preparation, the squad is ready to recite the, the key phrase. And enter the next test. Also, yeah. Don't mind my gameplay's a bit scuffed. I haven't played uh, Zenless and console for a good while. <laughs> Do you remember the key phrase to start the test? Yeah, it was that cool one. To feast on the city's delights. Yeah, that's not it. <laughs> or something like that. No, Sokaku. I don't think that was the phrase. <laughs> no, 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 no. It was more like, to shine the light of justice, eliminate all evil. Yeah, something like that. Yeah. Well, thanks for the follow. the version you wanted, Chief. Uh, the pixel laying. <clears throat> To protect the city, I shall become the light. It's rare for Asaba to remember such details, especially at work. You can recite the slogan this time. Wait, so you What's guys the hey, thanks for the ball too. you were embarrassed to recite it? <laughs> oh, fine, fine, I'll do it. But don't stare at me. It'll make it even more embarrassing. <clears throat> to protect the city, I, Asaba Haramasa, shall... Becomes the light. <laughs> Come on, it's not, not that embarrassing to say. As soon as he finishes speaking, a bizarre data loading noise fills the air. Uh. Yeah. With a mix of reluctance and embarrassment, Harmasa stands awkwardly, half committing to depose. An, an unnatural glow slowly envelops his body as the sharp details of his virtual avatar begin to dissolve into pixelate blocks, blending in right into a bright white hollow moments later. Oh shit. Is he kicked out? Uh-oh. Huh? The fuck? Why isn't the stage activated? Oh. Uh, Did I mess up the words in it? Uh. He's a bang boo now. Oh? 
Armasa, the hell? Uh. What? <laughs> why are you all staring at me, Enna? And why are you all so tall, Enna? <laughs> no, wait. Why am I talking like this, Enna? Enna. Uh, Asaba? Is that you? Uh, why are you a bangboo now? <laughs> What's going on? Is this some kind of prank, Enna? Of course I'm me. Armas turns to face the wall, and in the glossy reflection of the door, he sees an adorably round figure sitting back at him. Uh... What? <laughs> Enna! Enna! Harumasa turned into a bangboo. Hold on. No. Wait, wait, wait. Uh, Enna! <laughs> Why? Where's my body? Is this for real? Did I actually turn into a bamboo in the... I mean, sure, my old body wasn't perfect, but, but this... These stubby arms and this clumsy body... I'm totally useless in now! Um, also, is the audio working fine? <laughs> uh, let me just check as, uh, as well. Uh, yeah, let me just check if audio is working fine on this end. I think it might be a bit too loud, actually. Let me just lower that. <laughs> so god damn it what how, how many freaking artists are there on twitch that are just offering to like do artwork and shit i'm starting to believe it's a scam <laughs> uh yeah let me just check uh, the audio see if it's working fine you guys just let me know if, uh, if it's working fine at all Okay, sounds just fine to me, but, you know, you, you guys let me know if there's any audio discrepancies or anything like that. Anyways. Aw, cheer up, Harumasa. You're not useless. You're <laughs> the best. <laughs> Even as a tiny little bang boo. Now's really not the time for that, Enna. <laughs> okay, buddy. It's that person. The know-it-all intel officer dragging everyone down with her. Just as planned. My strategy worked. The enemy made a mistake. Pfft, keep deluding yourself. Thanks to your foolishness, those battles gave me all the data I needed to take over this system and soon to take over you. Your teammate's data model is complete. I've made some small optimizations to it. Ah, oh, shit. He'll be on a fast track to brain death. You bitch. Wh what do you want from us? <laughs> Didn't I tell you? I want revenge on the invincible section six. That Revenge for what? Was the first. Next is the kid, and then the hey. the Hoshimi family. He saved it from Sakaku. The know-it-all intelligence officer. I'll make sure you're the last one. Revenge for what? I want you to watch as your teammates, under your leadership, walk step by step towards the. Bang! And he's feeling blast echoes as Sakaka raises Haramasa booth and finally slams him into the TV, interrupting the venomous whisper. Sakaku? Damn, girl's pissed. Don't listen to that ugly loser, Nagi. I I don't really understand what it was talking about. But I do know one thing. It was showing its face now because it's panicking. Hey, is that why you smashed me through the TV screen, Sokaku? <laughs> oh, the screen is back to normal, Anna. Ah, oh, brother. I told you, I'm slowly seizing control of this system. Soon, I will be the god of this world. If I want it restored, it will be restored. And if I want you dead, you will die. But you said soon, right? That means you're not the god right now. I get it now. <laughs> too bad. It's already too late. That means you're admitting it yourself. 
You haven't taken over this system, and you don't have the power to change the rules. Yep, good on for you for snitching on yourself, dumbass. It's reassuring to see the rules in the technical manual still apply. If we kill all the test monsters, it will trigger the end of the test. We're heading in the right direction. You've provided me with very useful information. <laughs> Thank you for that. <laughs> you think you're so clever. If that's your conclusion, then you're even dumber than I thought. Let's see if you're still smiling the next time we meet. Yeah, we're totally going the right direction. He's trying to mislead us. If you're ready, let the VR test begin. Let's do this. Let's enter the test stage. Wait, Miyabi, I have something I'd like to say to everyone. And guess what you're going to say? Uh, this time our enemy is highly adept at sewing Discord. And, uh... <laughs> Naki cares about us so much, but they threaten her about uh, about us getting brain dead. Naki's really clever, but she'll be still be heartbroken after hearing that. How evil. Naki, we can't let these bad guys go. The more it doesn't want us to fight, the more we, we have to fight. Perhaps that's exactly... Uh, what our enemy wants us to think. Just like a game of chess. Our enemy may be uh, several uh, moves in advance. Indeed, we don't have enough intel right now, so we can't rule out any possibility. So, are you still confident in your judgments? I... Can I convince something to you, to you all? I never had confidence... I never... I've never had confidence in my judgments. Wow! It's number one on the, on the brain death leaderboard. It's really heartbroken to hear you say something like that. But Deputy Chief, it looks like you got more than just that to say, and now? Of course. I am the intelligence officer for Section 6, and rather than relying on flights of fantasy, I prefer to base my judgments on the rational analysis of objective facts. But I'm worried about everyone. I fear that the majestic forces of Section 6 might get caught up in, in a mistake I made. What the enemy said, that fear turns my stomach. But words alone cannot attack my confidence. One cannot destroy what has never existed. All I know is that the objective intelligence has not changed, or rather, that the latest intelligence only bolsters my previous hypothesis further. And so I ask you all to keep, so please keep trusting me. However, I have a small suggestion regarding our situation. What is it? Miyabi, Sukaku, try as hard as you can not to get into in involved in combat, and leave all the fighting up to me. Harmasabu can't fight right now either, which is which means not gonna be alone. Isn't that dangerous? I've enabled safe mode, and the enemy cannot hack into the system or collect uh, or meddle with any of my data. It's safe for me to fight. Uh, I may not like it, but I understand. Thank you. So then, let's become light and hunt, uh, hunt down the second runway. All right, here we go. There's our enemy. Um, real quick, I want to check something. Um, can I change the settings here? Options, here we go. Uh, audio, okay, audio's all maxed out. Uh, chessboard, camera influence. Oh, I can't change the FPS here, okay. Um, yeah, I can't really tell. Is it 30 FPS or is it 60 FPS? I'm not, I'm, I'm not sure. And of course, I only have Yanagi here. Alrighty, well. Yeah, that music is a bit too loud. Let me just like lower that a bit. <laughs> uh, just slightly. But like at 7. Uh, yeah, set it like this. Alright, let's go. Come back here. Hey, you sneaky little creep. Don't run, Nena. Uh, where are the what? others? Okay. Darn it. The path's blocked. Should we go around in the block <laughs> again? It's a dead end. Stay up. calm. Look around. Hmm. Oh, bust to the wall. The wall on the left doesn't seem very sturdy. It looks like we can break through it. Oh. All right. Keep going. <laughs> Get back here, shocker. Awesome, and I get the feeling it's trying to lure us in, and uh... At this point, the only option is to catch up Ow. and take it down as fast as possible. Whoa, okay. Yeah, forgive me if my gameplay's not as smooth here as it is on PC. <laughs> I tend to play better on PC than console. For Zenless, anyways. Good. Good. 
Boom. Ow. I really don't want these enemies that fucking nose dive towards you. Waste of time. Boom. Yeah. Oh, you're not dead. Die. <laughs> More of you idiots. Oh. Inron is going to control the camera here. It's like, damn. Oh, PC. There we go. Weak spot located. Boom. Got you. Oh, God. Yeah. Surrender. Boom. Oh, my God. Whoa. Okay. Yes. Good. Yeah, gotcha. Stop running. <laughs> so all people running to soft plug bugs during the user requests. Yeah, the soft plug I also encountered earlier. But I'm on PS5 right now and it seems to be working out fine. So thank goodness for that. Also I've heard on mobile it works pretty well as well. Alright. Keep going. Yep. Get out of the way, Hi, guys. Don't block the path. Let's make this quick. Boom. Those Harmasa, there's no point in like talking to these guys. They're like <laughs> AI, remember? Virtual reality and shit. I'm not gonna listen. <laughs> oh god, more views? Alright, fine. Let's get this over real quick. Boom. God, our place is so much fun. Yeah, more of you guys. Oh, this little idiot. Resistance is futile. Yes. Ow. Yes. Nice stuff. What you can't counter us as just Yanagi, but that's fine. Waste of time. Boom. Oh, you have a lot of HP. <laughs> yeah, it seems like like the bug's PC only. But it's odd because you know the most players are on PC. Let's not think. Actually, no, the most players are on mobile. We press on. So maybe they just didn't test PC at all. Oh, I should have let her finish her sentence. Oh. Wait. Oh, wait, that's Sakaku. Hell? Sakaku, Miyabi. Oh, no. There's nowhere to go. Jump. Oh, fuck. Nagi said we can't let the chief's data get stolen so quickly. Leave this to me. No. Sakaku is giving it her all. But even so, it won't be enough to hold out for long, Anna. Uh, hey, Sukishiro? Uh, oh, no, sure. <laughs> Hang on, Harumasa. Oh, no, Anna. No, no, Anna, Anna. <laughs> oh, shit. What the? What the fuck? Whoa, what? Nagi. Wait, is Harumasa attacking them? How? Yanagi. Wait. What happened? <laughs> Uh, oh, oh. Get oh shit. Oh god Christ, god damn it. I told you the resistance is useless here. Really? Useless? Hurting people like this. The special monster we're looking for. Oh. Uh. Must be you. Oh yeah, I'm gonna take you down with me, bitch. Die! <laughs> Oh, just slam against the fucking yes. ground. <laughs> Stage Die. Complete. Oh shit, we're done. I thought we got like one more. Uh. I knew trusting you was the right thing to do, Nagi. Yeah, that's the second, the second one, right? Is done. Woohoo! We're almost there. I don't like just sitting here watching while my teammates fight without being able to help. But I'm glad you're okay. 
Deputy Chief, now's a good time to act badass, right? <laughs> Maybe drop a cool line like, I'm just an office worker. There's something to rub it in, Nena. Shut up, Harumasa Boo. <laughs> Technically, I am an office worker. And you've done a great job as a bang boo, Harumasa. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah. Uh, yeah. Huh? Why has everyone gone quiet? Uh oh. Uh, oh god, this again. You curse you, a mere intelligence officer messing up my plans. You again? <laughs> Seeing us destroy two of the test monsters meant you finally had to act. With one more to go, your plan is about to fail. Arrogant as always, intelligence officer. Are you sure your teammates can hold out that long? I have faith in them. You know nothing of their strength. <laughs> you don't need your teammates to teach you how to act cool. You're pretty good at throwing out those cheesy comic book cool lines yourself. I'm just stating the facts. <laughs> You've tried manipulating the data, the terrain, the system, and you still can't beat us. I think knowing when to give up is a form of wisdom. Yeah, I agree with you on this one. Sometimes it is wise to give up. Oh? It's been a while since I met such a reasonable villain. I might try and get you some special treatment as a prisoner. <laughs> Maybe a pork cutlet that Tsukaku hasn't already nibbled at? <laughs> I mean, giving up on you. Yeah, that's what I figured. If it weren't for your interference, I'd have already dealt with those three. So I've decided to stop wasting time on you and focus on what's important. Hold on. What are you planning? Get out of my world. Stay out of my way. What is she? Wait. What are you going to do? Uh oh. Uh. What do you do? Wait. Wait. Oh, fuck. I got booted out. <gasps> Shit. Miss. Tsukishiro? You... You... I... Where am I? Is this... Ah! Mitsukishiro! You're awake! Thank goodness you're back. Oh, fuck. Oh, you're he did kick Yanagi out. Fuck. <laughs> well, now we got to go back in. Snack back to reality. Hi, Matt. Oh, Tabichi Tsukishiro, thank you the gods. At least you managed to wake up. See, the others... I see, the others haven't made it back yet. What I'm gonna have to tell you now is very important. Please listen to me ca very carefully. Okay. A team's consciousness are trapped inside that virtual environment, and they're under threat right now. Please call hand immediately and request a cybersecurity specialist plus a medical team. Before they get here, please block off the entrance and exit of the HIA club and stop anyone from coming in or going out. Got it, don't worry. Leave it all up to me. Hmm. Or who knows, maybe this staff guy is a hacker all along. Dear citizens, friends of HLE, loyal users of VR system. And premium, and premium users. Oh yes, and premium users. Thank you for all your support and enthusiasm. Our apologies, but we may need to extend our VR system maintenance today. Our career club will reopen once maintenance is complete. We sincerely apologize for the inconvenience. It's not a disappointing announcement. The crowd gathered much at the entrance. Is that a much of a reaction? Uh, it's good that everyone's staying so calm. By the way, Executive Officer of the Hollow uh, Special Operations Secretary will be resting at the, in the HIA during the rest, during the maintenance period, so... What, Miyabi Sama isn't coming? What the heck, I came all this way to see the Executive Officer of Section 6. You should have mentioned something in this important earlier. What do you mean, by the way? It's your system maintenance that's a real side note here. You know that the members of Section 6 wouldn't be appearing. The crowd of citizens reacts with surprising intensity. Well, we're so sorry. Deep apolo deepest apologies. In any case, please leave for now. We'll announce the opening time later. Thank you for support. God damn it. <laughs> These guys aren't true HIA connoisseurs. <laughs> really? It just ends here? Okay, it's probably just like part one or something, right? What on earth is going on? What's wrong? Something happened? That's ah, okay. Don't worry too much, Belle. I just feel like something has gone haywire over there. What, the HIA club? Yeah, Section 6 has basically vanished after going into the HIA club. Even their scheduled press conference has been cancelled. There's huge ruckus on the internet with people speculating what's happened to, se to Section 6. Let's pay close attention. So considering- so you considered 2, Bell. Well then, 
Fairy, please keep... Please uh, filter the internet using these keywords and keep me up to date with all the latest. Keywords, Section 6, HIA Club, and Hoshimi Miyabi. Also... Uh, Sukishu Yanagi? No face? No face. We're not getting proxies who claim to be equals of faith in. It's understandable you'd be curious. You know, they're definitely of concern here. <laughs> oh, our Bellamar's gonna do something and like... Help Section 6? Eh? Maybe? <laughs> okay, we're back to us now. Yeah, I'm gonna guess we're gonna probably help him out a bit, right? I mean, we have to. Yo, there's a boy, but unfortunately, <laughs> uh, we're not gonna get him until, like, uh, it's the second half of this update. Also, yeah, check handbook, because they do give some free polychrome sometimes. Alright, uh, let me just check here real quick. Our audio seems to be working fine for the most part, so I think I'll continue on from here. Alright, let's uh, maybe go save uh, the gang, wise. So, check out this real quick. There's some new info about Section 6. Are free to chat right now? Yep. Let's go. After the news on Section 6 concluded, let's compile the info from the internet selected by Fairy along with those stray morsels from the news. Firstly, Section 6 has to come out of the club. Plus, online reports have placed several experts in cybersecurity from both HIA and NEPS arriving at Luna Square. Guess like something's going down. That's what everyone's guessing, but nobody knows what actually happened. We go check it out, she go join the party. I knew you'd be keen to join in all the fun, Bell. Let's go, the car's ready. Faith into the rescue! A little early today by the HA Club. Oh, back to Yanagi. Login failed. Missing authentication information. Login failed, login failed. Shit. Damn it. I've been unable to log in ever since the system kicked me out. I tried everything, but the, even the login link disappeared in the end. It's been so long already. Sakaku, Miyabi, and Harmasa, I mean, Asaba. They're all suffering inside there, and there's nothing I can do about it. Deputy Sukishiro? Ah, oh, I'm sorry about that. I was daydreaming. Has a backup arrived yet? The professionals from Han have arrived. They're working on relinking the connection so you can re-enter the virtual world. I tried locking in using the original link. The system prompted said missing authentication information, but uh, ever since I've been here, ever since I've been here, I'm stuck with, with my team, whether in the virtual world or the real one. Can't figure out how there can be an authentication information that Miyabi, Harmasa, and Sakaku all have, but I don't. Even if that, even if they can create a new connection, I'm worried that I won't be the login at all if we can't solve this first. Do you have any, do your experts have any insights about that? We're working hard. My see, thanks for your hard work. We will never give up. Never. <laughs> what the fuck? Please don't cry. <sighs> I'm sorry. Uh, sorry. You only came by to help us out, yet we fall put you in danger. Seriously, please, can you stop crying? I'm really not very good at handling my work makes tears. Sorry, I'm just so sad. Uh, Deputy Chief Sukishiro, did you hear? I just went out to console all the Section 6 fans outside and they were all clutching onto all the gifts they wanted to give to their idols. I told them all to go and I passed them on for them, but you know what they said? They want to pass personally hand over their gifts to their idols, the guardians of your redo. We kept everything secret though. We didn't let anything out of the bag. We got no idea what their heroes are now on the brink of death because of our negligence. That's something I, I, I really, Oh, your whole expression just shifted just then, Deputy Chief Sukishiro. Uh, are you gonna take out your anger on me? It's okay, you can hit me, I deserve it. You supposed to assured I shall not be hitting you? <laughs> what he just said has remind me of something. Please hold on a minute. I want to run a quick fiscal diagnosis of my teammates. Uh, of course, sure. They're all under expert medical supervision right now. If you can provide some details about their health, it should be useful in stabilizing the situation. I understand, thank you. Oh boy. Fuck the research here, alright. I'm assuming I can't leave at all. 
right? <laughs> like, what if I try to leave? Yeah, no, I can't. Just wanted to check. Yeah, talk. Talk to me, boy. Talk to me. <laughs> How do you get past the glitch part? Because I'm playing on console on PS5. Uh, yeah, apparently um, PS5 gets through that. Like, yeah, P PS5 is not is unaffected, and I believe mobile is as well. Uh, Deputy Chief Sukishiro, thank you for all your hard work. I'm currently in charge of taking care of your three teammates. I got a qu few questions I'd like to ask you. Thank you in advance. As long as it helps with the uh, care, I'll gladly tell you whatever I know. Uh, we retrieved the basic health records of the three from the database, but something went wrong during the data transfer and we lost the info of each file's owner. I'd like to ask for your help in identifying which of the three records belongs to each executive officer based on my descriptions. I'll do my best. Yeah, I'm not sure when they'll fix it. Hopefully by, like, this week. Hopefully. It is annoying that, uh, yeah, like, so many people can't continue on with the store because of that. Uh... The first record, let me see. Wow, impressive. Looks like this was a petite Oni girl with exceptional physical abilities. Well, pfft. who do you think that is? Who do you think this file belongs to? Could it be Lady Miyabi or Mr. Saba? That's a Kaku. Do you really need me for this? For Via? Uh, the fuck? Via. <laughs> uh, I'm pretty sure that's a typo. You might not know exactly, but when would you guess? I'm gonna hope by this week, hopefully. Because Hoyo usually patches these glitches quick. The main is seem like, or like, really, really quick, so... Hopefully by this week, is what I'm estimating, like, when they fix the bug. Please, my team can't bear the consequences of a mistake. Fine, I think the person it describes is... Oh, Sakaku, right? Yeah. Understood. A second record belongs to a male officer. His bus... His waist and his hit measurements are... It's it's Harmasa, he's literally the only guy here. Come on, buddy. Are you really this incompetent? The last record looks like it belongs to a dignified, powerful female fox tyrant who wears a sword and has earned the title of Void Hunter. Her height is 170 cm. That must be even with the ears included, right? <laughs> yes, me, Abby. Dumbass. Understood. <laughs> Although I do wonder, what happens if you answer the... Uh... These one's wrong. <laughs> I wonder what he said. Just like, what? <laughs> uh, Deputy Chief Sukishiro, thank you for all your cooperation. All the data has been fully confirmed. Rest assured, we'll do everything in our power to take care of the three of, uh, the three of them. Secure sex is the protector of the city, a symbol of security for everyone. So, Deputy Chief Sukishiro, no matter what, please bring the three of them back, please. I will. You're the only one who can. Can I really do it? And now he walks up to them, quietly watching. Like the caretaker mentioned, the new Eridu uh, Guardian badge gleams brightly on the chests of the three. Their breathing is steady and their hands are warm. Anyone looking out for them would never think they were in, at the brink of death. Can't imagine the city without you, so I have to bring you back. Aww. Just then, a message arrives. The cyber warfare experts have successfully restored the connection gateway. Miss Tsukishiro, the login link has been re-established, but part of the system is still under the enemy's control. The message authentication information missing keeps popping up, so we can't log in. I have an idea that might be worth a try. No? What's that in your hand? Oh, a new Eridu Guardian badge? That's a really unique design. Is it official hand merchandise? That's not important. Please take this badge to the specialist team for analysis. The South Six uh, wait the badge for analysis before bringing him back soon after. This is incredible. Wait, do you intend to log into the system wearing this? It's the missing authentication information, isn't it? Yes, but it's too risky. Once you log in, you won't be able to activate safe mode. Ah, shit. Even the pain feedback protection will be disabled, and it could. There's something I'd like to confirm. What is it? Are the core system rules still in effect? I'm talking about the content in this user guide. Mm. This system creates an immersive virtual realm synced with the user's senses. Once all test monsters are defeated, the session will automatically come to an end. According to the specialists, these rules are intact, correct? Uh, of course! These are the core rules governing the VR system. Our battle with the enemy has always been about gaining control of the system. And they have neither the ability nor the opportunity to alter them. 
Hmm. Great. Then I'm going into the system. My teammates are still out there. Please assist me. I'm counting on you. <laughs> that was so moving. I'm going to God damn it. A dedicated fan club just for you. And one day, I'll make sure everyone in New Eridu is a diehard fan of Miss Tsukishiro. Okay, don't need to do that, buddy. Uh, you're thinking out loud again. No, no, that's just what I'm saying out loud. <laughs> My inner thoughts are way more embarrassing. Huh? If I say them out loud, you'd never look at me the same again. So I'll. Huh? Hey, look, huh? Oh god, he's imagining some very, very unholy things, I imagine. What the fuck? But since you've made up your mind, I'll give it my all to support you. I swear, as the founder of the Tsukishiro Yanagi <coughs> fan club. Sorry, this fucking choking my water there. What the hell? Yeah, this patch is way more sussier than the others. I can already fucking tell. What the hell? <coughs> okay, I'm done. I'm done coughing. <laughs> I pray to the founders of Eridu, to Lady Sunbringer, and the oh. leftover noodles from lunch. I pray for the safety of you and everyone in Section 6. Lady Sunbringer mentioned. Let's go. Thank you. <laughs> I'll make sure they all get back safely. Please just stay 10 feet away from me and don't fucking drool on me or anything like that. Looks at the HA Club, but nobody's here. I guess I was right. That was vet logging in uh, method. There's voices outside. Better head out and take a look. Okay. Anything in here? Uh, nope. Nothing at all. Okay, I'll be killed then. Hmm. Ah, shit. Hey, guys. Wait, so Kaku's a bang boo too? Shit. This is like something out of a nightmare. Oh, fuck. So this is what nightmares are like. Wait, Chief, you've never had one? Uh. <laughs> no, never. Damn, really? Miyabi's combat data collection progress is at 97%. Miyabi, there's no time! Please listen to me! Ah, shit. There's no need. Have you already uncovered the enemy's secret? Yes, Chief. Miyabi's combat data collection progress is at 98%. Oh fuck, I'm gonna have to fight Miyabi, aren't I? You've got a plan to take them down, right? I do, Chief. Miyabi's combat data collection progress is at 99%. Fuck. Then I'll leave it to you. Damn. Okay. Miyabi's combat data collection progress oh. has reached 100%. Data collection complete. Model construction in progress. Fuck. Up. Oh. oh no, she becomes a bang boo too. <laughs> right. To protect the city, I, Tsukishiro Yanagi, <laughs> become light. Let's go. Ah, oh, fuck. Here we go. Oh yeah, we're actually fighting outside Sorry, the HIA in the school. Leave the rest to me. Is it possible to log into my account and create on my PC? Yeah, you can link your pull your account from your PC to your PS5. You can do that. No matter how many cheating monsters show up. Yeah, you can you can do this like crossplay. Or cross save, yeah. <laughs> no, I won't. Don't worry. <laughs> All right, here we go. But yeah, it feels so weird fighting on the outskirts of a uh, freaking. Ugh. Oh god. Like fighting outside in the open like this. Ugh. All right, forgot these guys freaking self-destruct. Damn, they're really throwing everything at us, aren't they? Waste of time. Boom. Weak spot located. Bam. There. Come on. Go down already. Nice. Yeah, what, what's a plan here? Where are we going? Oh, God. Okay. Neo Radio's all topsy fucky. Shit. 
Ah, more people. If only I had a bang boo size sword. <laughs> I'd like to join the fight too, Anna. Ow. Don't worry, Chief. Leave it to me. Yep. Leave it to Mommy Yanagi. Yeah. Who else? Okay, you else. Hey, hey. Wow. Ah. Okay, that's it. Shall pay. They're all in. I oh, build that energy. Yes. Okay, where are you flaming? Oh wait, I got in front of you. Never mind. You that what? Up. She's coming. Hello? Oh fuck. What? Shit. Okay. Waste of time. So doppelganger Miyabi is now here too. Shit. Okay, I have to keep a look out for them then. Come on, stun him. Surrender. Ah. Oh, shit. We press on. Okay, I need to keep a lookout for that Miyabi from now on. Yes, shock, sorter. Whoa, hey. Don't do that. Fuck. Whoa. Uh, I'm fine. Oh boy, can't see time. Finish him! Ah, shit. Shit. My right hand, Miyabi. My right hand. I sprained it earlier, stopping the blade. It was back then. It'll lead to subtle changes in my movements. You've always looked after me. After all of us. Oh. You're the only one in this world who can capture it. Abuse or weakness. Yes. Thank you. <laughs> Chief. Let's go. <laughs> oh shit. Oh, what? Did she fucking sub time? <laughs> Holy shit! Ah! Uh, Check me. Boom! Perish! How'd you manage to dodge? Not today, you bitch. <laughs> yeah. Die, idiot. You fail. Uh, I'm back. Nagi, you did it. <laughs> Yay. I can finally clock out. <laughs> Are you ready? We're no longer bang Everyone's boos. Been alive for so long. It's time to go back to being human. <laughs> <laughs> you also kind of good about the glasses, honestly. Snap back to reality. Damn it, damn it, damn it, damn it, damn it. It's all because of that blasted intelligence officer. <laughs> Even I can destroy conscience, I'll make you pay. Oh, she me happy. Deep sensory sick and biological data all uploaded. They, they, they will finish what I started. No face. Well, not in here. Mm. Yeah, go off with your pathetic villain speech, why don't you? <laughs> Nagi, are you awake? Can you see me? Your hands are sweaty, Sakaku. <laughs> <laughs> they said, they said you're mine. They used a force that exceeded your physical limits in there. And 
but I thought if I caused your body to go haywire. <laughs> no. I see. I'll steer clear of that power in the virtual world from now on. Noted. I told you the deputy chief would be all right. <laughs> how do you feel? Sore all over? Maybe now you can relate to how I feel when I want to take a day off. Okay, Harmasa. I'm glad you're safe and sound too, Asaba. <laughs> However, I think you're cuter in your bamboo form. <laughs> deputy chief! First you slap me physically and now you hit me with words? That's just cruel. Thanks to you, we're back in the real world, Yanagi. Your strategy worked, as always. Once you're back on your feet, will you help me draft my will? No, do that yourself, dumbass. Now is really not the time for this, Chief. <laughs> and what's with the will all of a sudden? In large families like the Hoshimi family, such things must be sorted early. Oh, come on. Oh, I'm totally overjoyed to witness this reunion. I'm afraid I have to interrupt. Just to be on the safe side, we need to give everyone a quick medical checkup. Let's do it. <laughs> Accompanied by the HA medical staff, the group are underwent a basic health check and followed by a more thorough examination enhanced specialized uh, medical facility. Thankfully, everyone was fine. Two days later, in the second six office of the Han building. So, the virus was implanted in us by the enemy through that badge? Oh. Virus isn't exactly accurate. It's a set of identification codes that aren't inherently dangerous and don't actively emit signals. Mm. Their sole purpose is to be detected during a full body scan when the wearer logs into the VR training machine. But when red, it becomes a virus. Uh. It opens up a back door allowing the attacker to hack into the system. Or at least, that's what the tech staff reported. But, Deputy Chief, how did you know the badge contained this virus? Looking back, the only distinction between my actions and everyone else was I didn't interact with any fans before the mission started. Right. To ensure all the citizens who trust hand fill at ease, the higher-ups have consistently encouraged officers to treat the fans as kindly as possible. It's only natural everyone wears the gifts sent by the fans. So that pretty badge was actually something harmful. Mm. Oh no, I can't remember who gave it to me. If I could, we could trace it back to them, right? Don't worry. I've already asked reliable colleagues to follow up. Yeah, so I guess maybe some of those fans were like disguised as like people who want to harm uh, Section 6. Hmm. Interesting. <laughs> Have you spent any money on ZZD? No, not yet. I'm still in F2P as of right now. Although, I may break that one day for like a character I like. <laughs> Could it be an insider within the HIA? Hmm. I did have my doubts. But then I thought if an insider wanted to tamper with it, there are plenty of ways more subtle than implanting an identifier code. The most suspicious person, naturally, is the one who has the strongest reason to target Section 6 right now. Right. Fuckface. Oh, Section 5? No, not them. <laughs> now isn't the time for internal jokes. <laughs> Chief, you understand what I'm trying to say, right? No face. Uh-huh. We're just one step away from taking down their leader. If they were going to make a desperate move, now would be the time. Nullface once hacked into the HIA system and potentially gained access to internal intelligence. Furthermore, conducting electronic warfare through hacker groups has always been Nullface's specialty. Hacker groups. So in other words, the remnants of Nullface, who normally operate independently, mm. are now joining forces? This is their last stand. To efficiently organize their attack against us, they likely aren't too spread out, making it the perfect opportunity to capture them all in one sweep. Yep. Huh, they can't beat us in the real hollows, so they cheat in the game world? These guys aren't the worst. So, when are we going to go after them? Oh god, Sakaku so mad. <laughs> Look at her, I don't think I've ever seen her angry before. <laughs> Rather conveniently, the intelligence from our partner department has just arrived. How about we take them down today? Oh, right today? Alright, let's go kill them. <laughs> that night, Han resumed the previously cancelled press conference. The entire Hall of Special Operations Second Six Squad attended, announcing the criminal system a syndicate null face had been apprehended. Oh, just like that? We're not even gonna see them? They're just arrested. <laughs> That's it. <laughs> Damn. 
<laughs> Bell, did you catch that news bulletin? What's wrong? The second six called a press conference claiming that they've taken down Nullface in one fell swoop. That show was fast. Yeah, the previous rumor that had Second Six got into trouble with AJA Club while Han did nothing about it, which sent the rumor moon to overdrive. Now, all online speculation claims that Second Six was infiltrating the Null Face base the whole time to launch a sneak attack, and Han's lack of response was due to their fear of leaks. Seems reasonable. And we're just making blind guesses. I mean, it's not like anyone actually witnessed it in person. Ha. <laughs> they say that sleeping minds dream about those worries today. Maybe I have one of those dreams tonight. I'm thinking, Bell, why is in Section 6 bad hollow <laughs> big bad hall adventure? That sounds like a fun dream. Do we play the bad guys in the dream? <laughs> if Bell's a bad guy, then likes to be a bad guy too. After all, it's both of us that make a faith in. Feel free to agree with me like this. So how about it? You wanna experience that dream right now? Wanna go to HIA? Wanna go play VR? It's not too far away, so let's go check it out at the HAA. Okay, I guess we're not done yet. Let's go. <laughs> oh. Uh, welcome, citizens, to experience the latest VR system. Ah. You're Miss Sugishiro Yanagi. <laughs> what are you doing here? <laughs> You're the leader of the independent investigation team. I didn't expect to meet you here. I was just... One, two, three. Miss Sugishiro. A paragon of wisdom and bravery, for you will go crazy! Who are these people? We're Mitsukishiro Yanagi's fan club. I'm the chief of the administrator. Would you like to be interested in joining and becoming one of Mitsukishiro's loyal supporters? Everyone, what happened to our number one rule? Right, never cause trouble for the guests. What are you doing right now is causing trouble, you know? Right, well, obey your instruction. We'll disappear right away. Wow. My apologies. No matter how much I tried to stop them, they insist on forming a fan club, so I had to set some rules for management. I'm the invited spokesperson responsible for the safety demonstration of this new VR system. If you have any questions, feel free to reach out to me. <laughs> time slips by without notice and you end up spending the entire day at the HA club. By the time you turn home, it's already late into the night. You fall asleep without realizing, probably because you're exhausted. I'm gonna assume that's the end of the quest then, right? Yep. Quest finished. The brains of section six. That's a fun story, actually. That, that was really, really good. It's unfortunate that yeah, some people can't play it because uh, freaking it's bugged on PC for some reason. But hey, if you guys have a PS5, download ZZ and you should be able to continue it from there. That's that should be mostly fine. Also, yeah, uh, people told me that again, yeah, mobile it works as well. So while well, it's not the optimal experience for a lot of the, a lot of players, but it still works nonetheless. Yeah, hopefully they resolve that PC issue sooner or later. Yeah, that'll be the end of the story quests. God damn, that's a that's a really really good good quest actually. I enjoyed it, and I do want to pull for Yanagi. Don't get me wrong, but it's just that <laughs> uh, if Lyra wasn't in the same update, I might pull for her. But unfortunately, nah, I had to pick one or the other here. But yeah, that will conclude it for uh, yeah the Yanagi story quest, everybody. But yeah, that was a really really good story quest actually. I enjoyed it. <laughs> Although it seems that yeah, do we do we really just arrest like no face like off screen? <laughs> Like, really? But yeah, with all that said, folks, thank you all so much for watching once again. And I hope to see you guys again for tomorrow's stream for some more Zenless. Take care of yourselves, have a good night, and I'll see you all again next time. Also, yes, wish you guys the best of luck in pulling for um, Yanagi if you are planning to pull for her. I hope your 50-50s are all winning, and I, uh, yeah, hope all you Yanagi wanners will be Yanagi havers. But okay, boys, I'm gonna dip for now, fellas. Thank you once again, and I'll see you all next time. Alrighty, boys. Gonna go now. See ya.